Hey Aries, welcome back to Star of the Universe Tarot. We are doing the what you need to know in the next 72 hour reading. We are doing a you versus them reading just to change it up a little bit. If you guys do not follow me on Instagram, feel free to. I go live every Sunday for week ahead readings and every other week for love. I also do live full moon and new moon readings, which are always zodiac specific. If you guys want to check that out, I'm also open for personal readings. You could book that on IG. Um, I just recently did a collaboration with Joey from King Aloha Tarot. If you guys want to go ahead and check that out, it's a pick a card reading for the closure you need from your karmic connection. I'm going to have the link in the description box below as well as um, the link to my friend's music for Pacific Soleil. You'll have um, a link to one of her music videos there. She is such an angel, beautiful voice. Please check that out. She's a fellow LA Compton kid just like me. Speaking of which, also shop local and support small business by checking out their iVisions clothing, please. Another LA kid just like me, my friends. <laughs> and you, uh, I'll have the website in the link below, uh, the link to the website in the description box below. You guys, if you do not see that right away, I do edit the descriptions after I upload the videos. So go ahead and you could either wait so I, um, you know, till I do the editing, or you can pop on to any of the previous videos, and I'll, they'll all be there. All right, let's see. How's Aries coming and feeling? All right, we have Sisterhood of the Rose, Beauty and Devotion, Priestess, Mystic, Teacher. Okay, so I think that you've just found out, Aries, that you have a very, very on point intuition i think that some of you guys aries could be going through some type of initiation phase with the inner temple devotion i feel like you've devoted a lot of time to figuring out how to use your gifts and where it is that you need to move forward now i feel like a lot of you guys may have been pushed off the regular path and into a spiritual path um I'm feeling full energy here. You could be dealing with an, um, well, that's Aries energy, right? <laughs> so yeah, like I feel like, but so not so much as you jumped into the unknown as much as you were pushed into the unknown. But on some sink or swim Aries, I felt like you swam and you're actually coming out very beautifully here in your own energy. Yeah, look, because you, you were able to call in your soul family for help. I feel like the moment that you started um, really accepting that your 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 mysticism and the and your I feel like um, I feel like the, your own beauty and accepting yourself for for your gifts, you were able to call in a group a group of people for support. Which this is your soul family. This is your tribe. And now that you have your tribe with you, Aries, it's like you feel like nothing is, is impossible. Okay. How is Aries' person currently feeling? All right. We have the age of light. You've been training for this for lifetimes. Wow. So your, your person is equally stepping up here, Aries. I feel like you could have found yourself... Um, a very high vibrational soulmate here to start projects with or you could you could have stumbled upon your twin with the Pleiades under the deck yeah I feel like so double mission channeling and uplifting humanity that sounds like twin flame energy to me and then you have trust trust your path under the deck if you knew you'd be supported what would you do I feel like either you or your person Aries is about to take action because I feel like there could be a separation here, but I also feel like a coming together. Clarify Sisterhood of the Rose, please. Oh, oh, wait, come back. The star card, yes, because you've been going through that cellular healing. I feel like, I feel like you could have been going through some things, Aries, that that not many people go through on a daily basis i'm sorry i'm so hot and to be completely honest you could be dealing with an aquarius it doesn't have to be but i feel like you healing it, it um from the outside looking in i'm also feeling five of pentacles energy you could be dealing with the Taurus, but from the outside looking in it looked like you you healed miraculously out of nowhere and it's really like it's really inspiring soul family 
the nine of wands okay so some of you guys could be dealing with um a toxic family member that needed to be blocked um sagittarius energy here with the wounded warrior i feel like some of you guys could have been physically abused at some point aries definitely mentally definite mental abuse and emotional abuse there could have been physical abuse as well but this is why aries it, it, you're such an inspiration to everyone there the, how did you how did you heal from that the age of light please the moon card you could be dealing with a pisces cancer or a scorpio but somebody's secretly watching you someone understands everything that you have gone through and they're in complete awe there it could be an aquarius again but they're in a, they're just fucking amazed they're amazed that you were able to do this like not and and i'm hearing so quickly too like they just did nobody thought that that you were gonna survive look with the seven of pentacles under the deck everybody was waiting for the tower to fall so if you went through some kind of um near death experience aries you're being like you're gonna you're gonna get your rewards for that soon pleiades please the knight of cups you know what some of you guys might find out that if you did go through some kind of near-death experience that it actually had to do with the hand uh, the hand of somebody in your family possibly a virgo here or, or a water sign with the knight of cups but double confirmation with the water signs here with the moon and and the knight of cups but somebody wanted to see you single and i, I also feel like Okay, some of you guys may have gone through a miscarriage through the hand of a family member here. It could have been like the your baby's father or um, or it could have been with a fight with a family member. But with the Nine of Pentacles here and the Hierophant, like God is, is here to rectify this. Because they realized that, that they, they, not only did they realize that that was unfair, that was not called it was uncalled for and it was never in the cards for you to go through this aries so you're about to go through um some major i'm hearing some major upgrades clarify the star card please oh you got the queen of wands and the six of pentacles some of you guys could be dealing with a very toxic fire sign, a Leo, Sag, or an Aries, or just a low vibrational female in general. It could be an Aquarius again with the star card here, or a Taurus with the six of pentacles. But they are very, very unbalanced. And there could be some monetary transactions here that, that comes out um, that has to do with with some kind of um, abuse on your health here with the with the aquarius card because that's also somebody who's unethical and um with sociopathic behavior like this is the ten of cups under the deck family again clarify the nine of wands yeah because you don't want to engage with this person anymore if this was a if this was an uh if this was um a fiance or something like that the engagement has been called off obviously um but with with the moon card again under the deck the only thing that you're thinking about right now with the eight of cups is distancing yourself is secretly distancing yourself because you know i feel like you're afraid that this person is going to pop off again and you don't know when or where that's going to happen The moon card, please. Clarify the moon card for me, please. The seven of pentacles. Yeah. Somebody knew that you were pregnant. That's why somebody popped off so ugly. They didn't want you to have this baby. Aries. Clarify the Knight of Cups. Yeah, it was their wish fulfillment to see this, this pregnancy come to an end. Clarify the Nine of... 
I'm sorry, clarify the, the moon and the seven of pentacles, please. Yeah, okay. There's record of this, though. There is record. So if there was magic involved with the nine of cups, because that's a, that's a blood ritual, and um, the six of pentacles over here, that's monetary transaction. So there was records of moon magic that was being used on you to end this engagement or to end this pregnancy Aries these receipts are going to come out no later than the 26th no later than the 26th earliest the 12th of this month um and the thing is that you're going to get apologies and shit like that but it doesn't matter because I feel like a lot of it's, it's very possible with the ten of swords under the deck painful ending here that um people are going to jail People are going to jail for it, and it doesn't. It doesn't matter whether you push charges, because I feel like somebody in a higher, like higher up than you, is pre is pressing charges on this. Yeah, with the ten, of, the ten of swords stayed under the deck. Yeah, so there's nothing you can do about it. But this is ultimately this is your justice. Yeah, let's see. There's an investigation going on. There's nothing you can do about it. You're gonna find out though, sooner than later. But this is ultimately gonna be your. Um, this is your justice. This is your justice, Aries. So just go with it. Yeah, look. Don't let the past hold you back. Don't. The time to give rather than take. And emotions are running high. Just, just bring love into the situation and just let, let it, uh, let it flow smoothly. Okay, Aries. All right. That's what I got for you.